Greetings all eagles, dudes this then, back again to feast on more Tokyo Ghoul. Last time I checked out the backstory of Arima, as his early days were also spent hunting ghouls, showing that he was a prodigy pretty much from the get-go. But this time around, we get a little bit of the backstory of Shu. And while understanding Arima made a lot of sense, as he was a enigma wrapped in a mystery, and it was obvious that the series were trying to build him up into being a more important character going forward. We've already been with Shu for a hot minute, although Root A kind of completely pushed him to the side for a good while there. So I'm left wondering, what kind of significance can knowing more about <laughs> the gourmet actually have on the story? Well, the only way to find out is to watch it, so join me. Won't you? I swear, all the people we see in this series just out late at night when there's friggin' ghouls abound. Yep, yep. Perfect combination of muscles, those calves. Yep, that's you. They have called to me. See, it's hard to feel bad when it's just like, come on! Do you people really not watch the news? I saw your body. I could only think of you. Of course. I'm so obsessed with love. You have such a strong workout regimen. Assess your physical and mental stamina. As you strive to be the best. The best like no one ever was? It's incredible. Yeah, no one ever will be. I want you life for exactly this moment. It's like you're getting dissected by me. Jeez, I just can't stop shaking. <laughs> that is perfection. Oh my god. So I spend it to its maximum. Within the trouble of the adrenaline, the legs are suddenly leaping over the ground. A trace of wall to the muscle. Some line. Kind of make the permanent arrangement. Try to eat your flesh before it starts to spoil. You have my nourishment to make me shine even more. Jeez. Who's there? Alright, I got it. Ah! Uh, ah! Uh, here. <laughs> Uh, this is my first fight. Gosh, an incredible shot of you. Uh, it's glory. Uh, that's me. So, you don't like it? Nice to meet you. Uh, <laughs> what? Um, is she a human? Weird? Okay, so this was, is when he's a high school student. God, he doesn't look like a high school student, but most anime high school students don't look like high school students. Then again, there were kids in my high school who were it was questionable whether or not they were high school students smelled of a scoop friggin april o'neill over here i was lying in wait for her living a I'm completely sad for her. so so is this just gonna be a story about her just enjoying watching him and then it ends with her being eaten is that how this goes? Because I don't think I remember ever seeing her. What's your objective? I've already completed it. Tell you because I want to take an amazing pick for that. That can't be it. There's no way that someone could have a decisive scoop. I guess someone has to make a decision as me. Yeah. Are you still listening? Yeah, I heard you mumbling. <laughs> so you want to be excellent? If that's what you want, I can do it any time. Oh, no. <laughs> like, no, 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 please don't do that. Talk about it. I want some chocolate parfait. You haven't even finished the one you have. So, I'm surprised he didn't kill her. So he could eat a lot for such a little rodent. I'm gonna ask you something for the food. <laughs> oh, gosh, must be good. You the act of taking photos of sublime, is it not? Uh, so a kindred spirit to the point where you would give your life for it? I never really thought about it. I don't want to die. Oh, sorry to get tired. Thanks for the parfait. Later. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> also, he was popular in high school, even though he's such a weirdo. Good morning, Charlie Girl. An angel. Sorry, he says sheep stuff like that. See if girls would think that hey, he's a some kind of hurt. <laughs> All the girls are just like, fuck those guys. Yada yada, this is beautiful girl. Beautiful girls. <laughs> Like a freaking ninja. Hey, what are you doing anyway? We'll talk later. See ya. All right. Do you know her? Not sure if I say it, but she's famous at school for being an oddball. She your friends with you? Uh, somehow. Huh. Oh. Who's this? This world is so fascinating. <laughs> Just going around chasing cats. More interested in taking pictures than anything else. Uh, she'll make a good journalist at some point, maybe. Hanging out in trees and stuff. See yeah, what's going on here. Should I get rid of her for you? Huh. Who is this? I haven't met you a go so far, but this is my Besides, if I can overcome this issue, I feel like I can scale up again. I have to clean up after myself. Oh, how's that? Mean? Oh, yeah, he's like rich and shit. Right. I ashamed of myself. That's really not, like, that was really never portrayed well, like, in the main series. Outside of him owning the restaurant and all that. It's alright. I feel like they conveyed well enough. Good to get to her. Why not just offer? I don't get it. He, he must be fascinated. Be mind if I sit there. Oh, 
Who's this? Okay, with the camera, she cut a picture of me during my meal. It, it, it's true. He caught her. Huh. I know she killed her. Exactly. Because I have yet to grasp her true nature. I wasn't interested in her before, so I hadn't known what that little was. She is for being an oddball. It's so silly, but I guess it makes sense. We could be famous. You're also pretty much a celebrity here. Can you feel it? This is for a while. It says that none of your feelings have been found out yet, though. As you all look so conspicuous. That is a good point. Did you not notice her? As I didn't notice her because her dull scent does not stimulate my appetite at all. Dull scent. Yeah, so I see this show. Ah. So she has a scent that doesn't really interest most ghouls. Huh. Uh, she's just not an interest to his palate. God, it's weird seeing Shu have a normal conversation with people. You don't just brush him off, you know? <laughs> she's a maid! Horichi, her family is very ordinary. She did well enough for the entrance to enter the scholarship. Very hard off to find this school to close the school door. Nothing that makes her very much happy is photography, his club activity. When I spoke to the photography club, she said that there was something for the child had taken them. So she's just not interested in, like, pursuing anything professional she, it's just a whim for her interesting take it. so she has good shots and bad shots of course uh, so this is like a passion for her and she, i don't think she'd want to make it a job in either a sage like the terrorist number zero the fool such a weird interest he has because what you're trying to uh try to convince him she's become a curiosity to him let see how to show the us people i've been interested in people all my life you know it's sick <laughs> Are you listening to me? I'm starting to feel like Shu gravitates towards people who just don't like him or are indifferent to him. I think I want to tell you. I really love humans. Yeah, so much you want to eat them. <laughs> it's so blunt. Don't be like that. Uh, you know, he was not had the claws of eggs to live in the wild, but flourished across the air. That's the driving force behind them. And you still eat them? <laughs> yes, even though I eat them. <laughs> <laughs> what is this relationship? Still want to understand the true ass. Uh, the coffee is very hot. She's just ignoring the shit out of him. He's trying to be so deep and she's just like having none of it. Alright then, let's see and look at the other. Oh my god. Is he gonna. Ah, oh, come on. That was rude. The man has a heart to beat, but sometimes you see him sexually harassing the young nurses. Ugh, jackass. He gets what he has done so he doesn't feel any guilt. No one makes a fuss because he gives so much to the hospital. Oh. Is he trying to get a reaction out of her and say, like, you know, I have money, so even if you were to disappear, no one would really care because it's just like, ah, ah. my family's rich, I can do whatever the hell I want. I want to invite you to the dinner show, but I want you to carry your ticket with your own hands for a Saturday at midnight. You will sneak into that old man's room, then you will open the window for me. Huh, that's definitely going to take an amazing photo. Huh. <laughs> Is she actually gonna do it? Huh. Sleep. Yeah, no shit. More luxurious than most business hotels. Delicious honeydew. <laughs> nope. Ugh. Rotten. But the nurse hide. Nope. Don't oh, waste it on this old man. Oh, this is terrible. If you healthy, you old heck. <laughs> oh. I see you love. I can't go to the next room. You're like, even though you're better off dead. Jeez. I don't think so. How are you even alive? You're so gross. Just die already. Damn. So a favor and die. Jeez. Oh, shit. How are you? What's happening? When did he get in? This people a wonderful angel in white. This shit. How did he come from? Oh, you attack a little house first. Will you allow that? Ah, oh, shit. So was she his target? What do you think about her work, little mouse? She abused the patients like this night after night. But just like he forgets what he does to others. He forgets the things others do to him. Jeez. I don't know how he hurt her. He does not remember it. The other shit. Think that he just got the injuries on his own. That a wonderful plot. That's that's kind of fucked. Abuse of the elderly. Oh, that's a uh, cause. Like it's one thing that he's pervy, but it's just like. He said it himself. He doesn't remember that he's done, so he has no reason to feel remorse. He always thinks that it's just like a minor infraction. It's just like ah, I just did this one thing. I don't stop. I'll do it. I won't do it again. But he does it every time because he can't remember that he does it. I mean, damn, that's a rough one. Cause it's like I, I don't condone what he was doing, of course, but to be f abusing someone who doesn't have the wherewithal to remember what he's doing or what happens to him or anything like that, that's, that's really funny. <laughs> like, yo, no, not cool. That's a situation where it's just like, look, if it's really that much of a problem, you need to leave. Leave that job. Which can be easier said than done. Jobs are hard to come by in certain situations, but man, that that's really fucked. Think you could become good friends with it. 
It stood it to be accepted that the skin of the age man is a delicacy. She think it all the texture and thickness of his clay. Oh shit! Oh jeez! He tried this as it on the skin cut inside a smooth and moist with blood. Jeez! I feel like they just wanted to animate him doing this texture. That's nice as a big blood. He is a shady man. Value. Oh jeez! That's like powder. Delicate. I give you anything, money, property, I beg you. Oh jeez! This is a really fucked up situation. He has this religion that takes no heed when others are suffering. It does not bother you. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> she didn't even register what he said to her. <laughs> she, 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 this, there's this wildly, supremely fucked up situation going on where it's just like, God, it's this rich asshole who knows how he got his wealth, who knows how he lived his life. Maybe that's a good thing that he's being, he's suffering like this. It's really hard to tell. But this old man is getting abused by this hospital staff because, but it's mostly happening because he's a perf and a lech and <laughs> he's about to be devoured and he's suffering and when he's begging for help, this nurse is just like, yeah, yeah, nah, none of that shit. And she's just taking pictures indifferently. And it's just like, what? Uh, I think I can understand why she has such an interest in her. Because it's just like, vacant mind does not register what's going on. It's just like, oh, that's interesting. Snap. Oh, that's interesting. Snap. Like, the world could be burning down around her and she wouldn't even register it. She's gonna take a picture. You've been fascinating until the very end with your time, you know. In this unjust world, death is the only certainty, you know. Huh. Answer me right now. What's showing in your eyes? Head empty. See what you think, Miss <laughs> She's not gonna give you the response you're looking for. The air feels great. Uh, what sort of person are you? She's not as complex as you think, dude. You try to get some kind of sobbing reaction or... No, she just cares about the picture. Huh. And she'll take a picture of this too, won't she? Yep, she'd do it right up until the end. Yeah, I figured as much. <laughs> She's too fascinating for him to just give up on. That is so weird. But this nurse isn't gonna live, is she? Easy. Uh, forget, forget all the things she did to. I won't. What did you say? Uh, oh shit! Did she kill him? Oh. <laughs> I'm alive. Lucky. <laughs> God. She makes me kind of think of gold from Hunter x Hunter. It's just like, eh, if I die, I die. It, it is what it is. Of course, I get it now. What do you get? I thought it was strange when I tried to catch you. But when I think of it as being the same as how people keep having it makes sense. I'll make you my pet from now on. Yeah, no thanks. And I think, do you know about scheduled blog posts? They should have my set to post a picture of you eating with the catch in. Yeah, <laughs> the culprit. What? So even if she died, she'd have outed him. Since I'm alive, I'd better delete it. <laughs> well, she... Okay, that's... <laughs> it... Okay, is she... I guess that's what they were explaining before. Like, it's hard to tell if she's a genius or an idiot. Maybe a little of both. Wait, I don't have my computer. What can I do? Call a taxi. You can use, use my computer to delete it. So guys, if I even go to his house. I still don't even know. No, I, I don't think most people would be interested in you in that way. You sure have a twisted mind. Uh, Shoo, aren't you gonna take care of that situation from up top? Uh, start with the dance again. Oh, that's your wish. Oh, did the nurse just slaughter the guy? Okay, that is wild. I have so many questions now. So Chie lived in the end. Did, I guess she's showing up in like rude, uh, Regul or something? Ah, but we never saw her in the main story. That's wild. And did the nurse slaughter the dude? So she could blame it on a ghoul? But the way you, the blood all over the place is just like, that. That's not the work of a human being. Was the nurse a ghoul? Ah, oh, that is wild. This was shorter than I thought it was gonna be, too. Then to get to a certain degree, I, I don't think you could tap that moment with Chie just falling out of the window. There was something weirdly poetically beautiful about it, and her just snapping away at pictures as she fell to her death. Oh, patient slaughter and tragedy at the university hospital. But did it just become an excuse for the nurse? It seems that she has received no punishment. That makes me sad. So she got away with it scot-free, huh? Is your fault in the first place again? <laughs> 
I've done. She always had a hidden cruelty. I could sense it. True. Recently, I saw her again. I saw her again. But you also have weird. Aaron has been supporting her because her patient was murdered. Really? Thanks for that, she was able to serve when the doctor hadn't noticed her before. <laughs> she see that for you? Oh my god. Wow, that is... Oh, wow. This world is so fucked. Because it's like, you can commit murder, and it's just like, oh, what's a ghoul who did it? I'm like, oh yeah, ghoul, ghoul. Then again, the CCT can come in and be like, yeah, something's not right about this. But who knows? They could just say, oh, it's a ghoul who's masking themselves of a murderer. Like, the logistics of some of this stuff is just like, what? Uh-oh. Is she gonna let this... He's gonna save her for later, is he? There's nothing more powerful than the Queen of Tragedy. I look forward to the time when she's flambeed by happiness. Uh, yep. But that is not enough. It's just love like for a extravagant gourmet meal. So, <laughs> God, so weird. What a wild ride. You know, because it feels like, just like Jack, this didn't really show me anything that I would have guessed or known or... Uh, it could have been passed off as like a few lines here and there, but it was kind of fascinating just because of seeing Shu in a different environment, you know? And this Chie girl is fascinating. There is a character type they the, the creative team behind this, because I know this is based on a light novel, so I don't know if it was the original author or the original mangaka of Tokyo Ghoul who developed this story, but they really like pitting Shu who is just this grandiose and flamboyant and extravagant person contrasted with people who just don't care for him. And I think that's what really makes the interactions with his character so fun. They love having him go on these out there monologues about the delicacies of human flesh and consuming someone and just these insane tirades and these absolutely horrifying looks and just just going on and on and on and on and then you have the people who just disregard him and it's like she is a monster not an out monster because of just how much delight he takes in consuming people and yet he's one of the few characters who has just persisted for so long and i i get why the mangaka left him around because it's just like He's a fascinating creature. He's a monster, but he's so fun that you love to just take the piss out of his characters with be it Kaneki or Toka or Chie here. Characters who just are not into his bullshit or whatever. It's like, thinking about it now, it's like, would I like the story more without Sue in it? Honestly speaking, I don't think so. He really is a fascinatingly disturbing character and the whole situation behind that thing with the nurse and the patient jeez i read through the manga because the anime I, the An tokyo ghoul anime doesn't do shu enough justice there are some things he does in the manga like taking a woman's eyeballs and only her eyeballs just God, and this this special, this OVA just serves to remind you that she's out there doing some really whooped up shit. I am fascinated by the Chie character too. Like wondering what capacity will she appear in again? Because it's just like, she is such a fascinating character. Because one moment she's just not registering anything that's going on around her. Just giving this vacant stare and just going with the flow of everything going on around her. And the next thing you know, it's just like, oh, now she's done this elaborate thing that is just like would have screwed you over at the last second. Well, I'm interested to hear from you. What did you think of Tokyo Ghoul Pinto? I heard this came from a collection of short stories, and uh, it seems as though it never could come to pass now. It would have been great to have had more OVAs based on those side stories, although I know a lot of them took place during the days of Kaneki working at Inteku, which probably would have great made for good filler material for the anime in general, helping to endear us more to Inteku before its eventual fall. But this was a good story. Help me get to understand Shu just a little bit more and be horrified by it. But let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. Also remember to like, subscribe, and hit the bell for notifications so you don't miss out on the next video. But until the next time, I've been the ghoul known as Do's Diz Din, and I hope to see you, my eventual meal, in the next video. Until then, bye bye.